Hey, Scott here. Scotty's Animals, I'm with Ursula. Uh, we're, we're out of guinea pig girls up in the front. So, Completely. amazing actually. I mean, there's a couple bonded pairs of girls, but there's no single girls for adoption. And two people just came in just now looking to pair up their girls. And we don't have any that haven't just come in or are under pregnancy watch or whatever. So we're back in the barn. We're gonna hunt for some girls. Saskia gave us permission to get eight girls. So let's get them. I'll, I'll, for the first half, I'll just watch you hunt them. Let's go, get them. Tupperware. Okay. I don't want to hear any comments about Champy. Champy's lived here. Champy's sniffing your butt. He's getting to know you. Okay, so these pigs on the floor are all available. Um, do you want me to bring the... Let's bring this in here so it's easier. Okay. Who do we have? Piggy number one. With a crest? Aww. She's in a goody. All right, put her in there. Yeah, she's in a goody. There's a whole bunch under there. Guinea pig fishing is what this is. Who's that? A silver agouti abbey? Wow. Watch out for Champy. Yeah, she is. I think we can fit them in there. We don't have to get all eight right now. Hello. Oh. Oh, that's another big girl. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we got three. Oh, she's sent a whole, a whole horde. Oh, look at that one. Look at this pretty long hair one. None of these in here are potentially pregnant, right? Do they? They. Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. Look, Look at. at oh, that one's so cute. Yeah. We gotta prevent her from being named Reese's. What's this flickering <laughs> light? Oh, look at that. Oh, that one's so cute too. Let's see if I. Yeah. Oh, I got her. I got this. I got one. <laughs> Look at this one. She looks like a little lion. Come on. <laughs> oh no, a Reese's and an Oreo. Forgive us, guinea pig gods. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more. I want to go. I want to go. Let's get a great one. Champy. Oh, Champy squirming. Champy thinks he has thinks he's a guinea pig. They're all lined up towards the back, like don't touch me. Oh, <laughs> they are. I want that one over there, the gray one. Can I catch that one? I doubt it. Ursula is on the prowl. Look at her on the hunt. Ursula is an apex predator. Oh, wow. The wolf, La Loba, has caught her prey. Oh, oh. <laughs> I've never seen a wolf uh, console her prey, though, like that. Okay, that's eight. All right. We could take a cart. Oh, my goodness, this is heavy. Yeah, look at this fluffy butt. Everyone's going to be all over this. Don't tell anybody anything. <sighs> <laughs> Oh, this picture is a fluffy butt. Guinea pig curls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my gosh. Nine, ten. Okay. All right. Well, actually, I want to take this opportunity to talk about something that I've seen a lot in the messages and I've been getting messages about, and I've seen this actually a lot in the groups. People are saying that their vets are telling them that their guinea pigs are overweight. Guinea pigs can't be overweight, okay? 
If your guinea pig is eating the proper diet of 80% Timothy hay, a bowl of high quality pellets, and not too much fresh veggies, then they're not gonna be overweight. It's better for guinea pigs to be plump and juicy. Now Ursula's doing my job. We're gonna get these girls up to the front. They're one step closer to finding their forever homes. Ursula's gonna try not to hit the tree. My hands in the cart at all times. This is fun. It's like a amusement park. Look at all the stuff Cowboy Luis has planted there. That's sorghum, believe it or not. That's the same stuff that I used to make my gluten-free beer. All right, guys. We'll see you next time. Say bye. <laughs> yeah, we're having too much fun. I'm about to fall out of the cart. <laughs>